EastEnders confirms major exit as murder story takes another unexpected twist. There is confusion aplenty in EastEnders next week when residents hide big secrets and some form new plans. The BBC One soap has been high octane for the last two months following the Christmas murder and the approaching week is set to be no different. Nish Panasar continues to hang around where he's not wanted and devilishly tries to get his hands on some of the Mitchell fortune. Kat Slater, who has been seeing Nish, grows suspicious of ex Phil, believing him to be withholding information about his money in the divorce proceedings. Spying an opportunity, Nish introduces Kat to his dodgy lawyer, Roger Peel, hoping that she will take the bait. Kat has a plot of her own and hopes to pull the wool over scheming Nish's eyes but Nish works out what she's up to and a horrifying attack ensues. After the intense scenes, Kat makes her way to number 32 to speak to Stacy, Eve Unwin and Suki Panasar, filling them in on what's happened, with the women subsequently humiliating Nish. About time he got what he deserved, right. Unfortunately, it's Nish who has the trump card here, as confirmed in my pictures, as he retaliates by calling the police regarding the events of Christmas. It's not just Nish who's lingering too long either, as Dean Wicks is still causing trouble. Next week, Jade wrestles with her guilt as she tries to muster up the courage to tell her dad that she's moving to Pakistan with Shabnam. After a heart-to-heart -heart with Jean Slater, the pair head to Beale's Eels to break the news. Dean, however, reacts badly. Các bạn vừa theo dõi một sản phẩm của OK Super Lanster. Xin chào và hẹn gặp lại các bạn video tiếp theo.